Hi everybody, hope you are all well. So I've got quite an easy set of nails and then I'm doing some 3D work which um, I haven't done a lot of 3D work on my channel before so I thought that I would upload these as they're a beautiful Christmas set of nails and I'm coming to the end of my Christmas videos which I'm really sad about um, but it'd be nice to get back to normality because um, I've been so busy this Christmas um, making everybody's nails look fabulous and mine look like crap um, so so anyways we've went for not a square set of nails we've rounded the edges off so um a lot of people call them like squovel set of nails um so i'm going in with cjp's um crystal clear and i'm also going in with just a white iridescent glitter um i can't remember which of my sellers that um i purchased this one from but you can use any white iridescent that you wanted um and then these gorgeous iridescent snowflakes are from diamond glitters um and I went onto our website, um, so not an eBay shop, a website, and I purchased these. Um, I think she's putting a lot more on our website. So if you are like a normal buyer from Diamond Glitters and you can't see a lot on her eBay page, then check out um, her website. So anyways, just in the tacky layer of obviously the acrylic, I'm just pushing them snowflakes in. So I'm putting two per nail. Um, and just pushing them into that wet layer and then obviously once they're dry I will encapsulate them all. So I have left this video a little bit longer than I normally do um, because obviously the 3D work but obviously I just wanted to show you it in a little bit more detail of how obviously I do do my 3D work. And I'm so gutted that I didn't record my snowman and I think that my snowman is better than my reindeer. Um, but you can see what you think. They both looked really nice. So this red is from Liz Acrylics Nails. Um, I've used quite a lot of her glitters recently. Um, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's just a classic um, like a Dorothy Slip Ads type red. Really sparkly. Perfect for this time of year. So just to add a little bit of red Christmassy feeling to there. We'll just pop this onto the ring finger. So once obviously they had dried and stuff which doesn't take long then I'm just going to go in and encapsulate all of them with CJP's crystal clear now can I just quickly say that CJP's crystal clear glass is like flipping glass it really is when you put your gel top coat on them glitters just shine through because I've actually well at the t like now when I'm talking now um I've actually run out of CJ pain it's just taking a little bit longer to come due to Christmas post but obviously I've had to go back to my Neo Nails clear powder and oh my god what a difference I've noticed of just how clear CJP's um crystal glass really is so um Anyways, once I've done all of that and I've done all of my filing, um, then I'm just going to go in and gel top coat all of these with Madame Glam's No Wipe Gel Top Coat. I absolutely love this. And just look how sparkly these nails look. I mean, I could have just left them like this and they would have been absolutely perfect. But ever since this client has been to my house, because um, I have all of like little nails on like the poppet sticks, um, as soon as she's seen my 3D like re reindeer she was like I have to have them for Christmas so anyways I'm going to pop this on all of the nails making sure that I cap the free edge and I'm going to pop this into my LED lamp and cure it for 30 seconds so obviously it comes out with no tacky um, coat on it so you're free to go and do whatever you want to do so I am obviously doing this reindeer now I have made it too big for the nail I know I have because I didn't leave any any room for the flipping antlers um but anyways i'm going in with neo nails um brown but this does have a shimmer in it as well so i'm just using my alpha number eight brush to no it's not alpha number eight brush it's cjp's um number eight brush so um i'm just kind of making the shape of the reindeer now when I done this, I was I thought it looked like um you know Toy Story, you know Mr. Potato Head. <laughs> I personally think it looks like that, but hey, it's 
still look like a reindeer as well so it's a cross between Mr Potato Head and a reindeer but I tried my best my client absolutely loved them um, it's just a little bit fun for Christmas but definitely my snowman was better so anyways I'm kind of making like one like a figure of eight if you get what I mean, you know, without the circles like taken out. Um, so that's like the initial shape. So if a nail had have been longer, it would have been perfect. I would have been able to get the antlers on perfect. Or if I had made it flipping smaller, then obviously that would have as well. So just picking a tiny ball of um, Snow White from CJP and just taking the liquid out of the back of the bead. So obviously my eyes aren't going to run all over the place. Um, and just placing them in. And then I'm going to go in with Neo Nails um, Dorothy Slippers for its nose which is a beautiful glittery red um, and then it starts to look like a little reindeer um, so then I'm going to go in with black which is also from CJP and just to make its mouth um, especially when you're working with three when you're doing 3D as long as your bead of acrylic is not sapping wet um, you know and that you do drain the liquid out the back of your bead then obviously it's easier for you to work with it if you've got it too wet and it starts running all over the nail then obviously you're going to have problems and you're not going to be able to mold um, you know what shapes that you want so I'm just making his little mouth here um, and then I'm going to go in with a tiny little bit black for his pupils um, I think it's a him it doesn't look like a who um, so do you not think though once I've put the black on the eyes that it looks like Mr Potato Head <laughs> It is. Please tell us that it's not just me. Leave it in the comments below, guys, if you think that it looks like Mr. Potato Head. Um, so, anyways, I'm going to go in with some white and try and squeeze some antlers into here. Um, so, I've done the best with the room that I had. And you can still tell that it looks like antlers and that it's supposed to be a reindeer. Um, so anyways that's just what i'm doing for the minute um just making like one on each side and then i put like two little well i suppose they look like stick stone the kind of thing you know like antlers um like either side um and that's about it really as i say the snowman i done exactly the same i made his body um like obviously bigger at the bottom and she didn't want it to have a carrot nose because she really liked the glittery red so um instead of a carrot nose it has a red sparkly nose um and if you can hear some banging and clattering in the background i'm sorry that is just my children um obviously they are off school for the christmas period um so once obviously i was all done and everything was dry and i was happy with it then i will just go in with some cuticle oil and apply that to all of the nails and that's it guys so i've left some pictures at the end i really hope that you enjoyed this fun set of nails um and i really hope that you all have a merry christmas and a happy new year um and yeah so i will see you in my next video bye